C, D, E, F, G, H, I, I want A plus B, because it does so much fun. Something new every day. Learn the A plus away. Hey, hey, it's time to start the show. Are you ready? Good plus, here we go. A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z. Hello and welcome to A Plus English. My name is Reese. And I'm Chickling. And today we've got an interesting topic for you. We are going to be talking about mobile phones and, more specifically, an app that we all use. Every day, especially here in Taiwan. Mm, okay, the green you, one, right? Yes, it's, it's the green one. Do you know what it is? Line. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, most countries don't use Line, but in Taiwan, we do use it pretty much every day, mm-hmm. and uh, it takes a lot of my time. Oh, really? So mm-hmm. you use it every day? You talk to people every day? Every day, school friends for work, talking to regular friends. Uh-huh. It takes up so much time. I know. Uh-huh. So our warm-up question for today is: What do you use your phone for most often?、Mm, I use my phone for shopping every day, not for clothes, but for shopping. Shopping like for、uh, groceries. For, yeah, groceries. Oh wow! There's so- an app that's called、um, the Bear Mama. I'm not sure if you've heard of this before, but it's like you can shop for anything on there, and then you choose the time you want to receive them, and、I、then、see. they're gonna deliver into your house. That's really convenient.、Yeah. I mm-hmm. mean, Taiwan is the land of, of convenience.、Mm-hmm. Um, I don't really use shopping apps very much because I think they're kind of dangerous for me.、Oh, I、yeah. have a very addictive personality. Oh, okay. But I do use it for playing games. Okay, what what games do you play?、Mm, Pokemon Go. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Pretty much every day, as soon、mm-hmm. as I wake up, I'm checking my Pokemon, see if they're doing okay, and well, catching some new ones. Well, my dad plays it too. <laughs> He does. It's a great way of getting exercise. I know.、Mm-hmm. So here we are. We're talking about Line, and today we're just going to begin, and we're going to get into the history of Line today. Yeah, history of Line. A plus encyclopedia. The history of Line. Warm-up question: What do you use your phone for most often? Hello, and welcome to the show. Today we're going to talk about a smartphone app. The question of the day is: Why did Japan first create the Line smartphone app? A. It lets people talk without a phone system. B. It helps people pay for things more easily. Or C. People can use it to order taxis. The answer is A. It lets people talk without a phone system. In 2011, a terrible earthquake hit Japan. It killed 16,000 people and broke large parts of Japan's phone system. People couldn't call their families to check on them. A South Korean internet business in Japan wanted to fix this problem. They made Line so people could chat on smartphones through the internet. Line doesn't need a phone system to work. Now, about 21 million people in Taiwan use Line. Word power. Create. Create. My brother and sister created a new game. They made it up by themselves. My brother and sister created a new game. They made it up by themselves. System, system. My office changed our computer systems, so we are learning to use new programs now. My office changed our computer systems, so we're learning to use new programs now. Business, business. My uncle's business sells beds and sofas. My uncle's business sells beds and sofas. Fix, fix. 
Jerry asked his dad to help him fix the problem with his bike. Jerry asked his dad to help him fix the problem with his bike. 认识智慧 Smartphone. App. Application. Chat. Okay, so Chicklin, today's article actually begins with a question. Let's see if we can get the answer right.、Mm-hmm. So the question is, why did Japan first create the Line smartphone app? I have no idea.、Hmm. But we have a first word, right? We do. Before、mm-hmm. we move on, there are some words that we should talk about, and the first word is a verb, and that verb is create. C R E A T E, create. And to create something means to make something, to bring something into existence. This could be a real thing or just an idea. I love creating sculptures and paintings in art class. So a word power example sentence would be: My brother and sister created a new game. They made it up by themselves. My brother and sister created a new game. They made it up by themselves. Okay, so create 就是创造的意思。那么我们后面加上名词呢，就会变成制造什么东西。譬如说 ，create problems like a problem maker. Maybe 你就是制造一些问题啊。You can create opportunities. 你可以制造机会。你也可以制造责任 ，responsibilities or jobs or money, anything. 那么 creative is the adjective form of the word. So when someone is creative, they have good imagination. Where they're really good at coming up with original ideas, so we can make a sentence with the adjective. Marco is creative. He always has cool ideas coming up. 那么呢，它的名词创造力就是 creativity。那么创造出来的东西或创造的事物就是 creation。所以课文例句呢，就是我的哥哥和姐姐创造出了一个新游戏，他们自己想出来的。那么，所以第一个老师刚刚问的问题就是，为什么日本首先创造了 Line 这一个智慧型手机的应用程式呢？ Would you consider yourself a creative person, Jigglin? Ah,、uh, sometimes. Well, it depends on what it is. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, me too.、Um, well, what about you? Well, I'm, I'm, you seem like a very creative person. I'm creative when it comes to ideas, but when it comes to creating art, like with paintings and stuff, I'm terrible. Oh, really? Yeah, I just can't use a pencil. <laughs> well, the next word、uh-huh. is smartphone, which is spelled S M A R T P H O N E, smart and phone. And a smartphone is a kind of mobile telephone that many of us use every day.、Uh, a smartphone can do more than just make phone calls. You can play games, surf the internet, and watch videos. Okay, so a smartphone 就是一个智慧型手机啊 ，like a smart flask. Maybe I have one. 一个就是一些很智慧型的东西都可以叫做是 smart 什么什么。Yeah, like I have an Apple iPhone, and that's a kind of a smartphone. Uh-huh, uh-huh.、Uh, and then the question also used the word app, which is spelled A P P. And an app is a piece of software you can download and use on a smartphone or some other kind of device.、Uh, some apps like Facebook or Instagram are used for talking to people or posting photos,、mm-hmm. but other apps like Candy Crush or my favorite Pokemon <laughs> Go are for playing games. So, what's your favorite app, Chicklin? The Bear Mama Shopping Happy、oh, Shopping、course. app. <laughs> so then. App 就是应用程式嘛，那么不要讲 app。Like in Taiwan, everybody says app. That's wrong. It's app.、Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, but app we understand that. As yeah,、well. that's true. <laughs> so let's continue with the article. The article continues with the answer being a.、Mm-hmm. It lets people talk without a phone system. So that was one of the answers to the question. Yeah,、earlier. I think it kind of makes sense. Hmm, it does make sense.、Mm-hmm. Uh, and we also have a grammar point here too. Oh, okay. One grammar point that we should talk about is the word "lets" here.、Uh, so to let means to allow something to happen. In this case, Line lets people talk to each other without the need for a phone system. Hmm. So it is "rang" or "rang" or "rang." So it means that it lets people talk to each other without the need for a phone system. Hmm. So it means that it lets people talk to each other without the need for a phone system. Hmm. So it means that it lets people talk to each other without the need for a phone system. Hmm. 代表他不让我使用他的车，或者是让我试一下吧。Let me have a try. 这些都是 let 的用法。And our vocabulary word is the word system,、mm-hmm. which is spelled S Y S T E M. And system is a noun, and a system is a set of different parts working together to make something work. A system usually has many parts, and sometimes if one part of a system stops working, the whole system might fail. 
A system can be a physical thing, like the phone system in the article, or it could be a plan, or a process, or a way of operating. And so, an example sentence using system would be: My office changed our computer systems, so we're learning to use new programs now. My office changed our computer systems, so we're learning to use new programs now. Right, so system 就是系统哦。那么我们的免疫系统啊，就是 immune system， 或者是电脑系统 ，a computer system， 这些都是可以用的。那么有一个片语啊、uh, ，to get something out of one system。So when you do that, that means you get rid of your emotions, wishes, especially a negative one, by doing something about it or by allowing yourself to express it。或者是呢 ，if you do something enough, so you don't want to do it anymore。你就是可以说 I want to get something out of my system. 这些是蛮好用的一个片语，大家可以试试看。那我造一个例句哦。I usually write a song when something awful happens to me. It really helps me get it out of my system. 代表呢，写歌可以帮我啊、呃，让我忘记掉一些我心里不愉快的事情。那我们回到老师的例句，我们办公室的人呢，把电脑系统更换了，所以我们现在正在学习使用新的程式。And then the article does continue with two more possible answers to the question that we had earlier.、Mm -hmm. So answer B is it helps people pay for things more easily. We can do that online too. So, um, well, I think it's B, right? 好了，它这边是它可以帮助人们更轻松的付款。Do you think it's B or A?、Mm, it could be B, could be A, maybe it could be C. Oh, okay. Let's, Let's have a look、going. at C. The article continues with C. People can use it to order taxis. 啊、uh, ，人们可以用它叫计程车，大家有叫过吗 ？My my friend used that function yesterday.、Mm -hmm. Really, to order taxis. Right, line taxi.、Okay. Mm -hmm. So I think all three answers could be correct, but I think one of them is more correct than the other two. Yeah, yeah. Which one do you think it is? If it's about history, um, I think I'm choosing A. Maybe I'm not really sure, but we. I I think, I think I think I think A is the correct answer. Okay. And we're going to learn in the article about how A is the correct answer for why line was created in the first、okay. place. So let's continue with the article. It says, in 2011, a terrible earthquake hit Japan. 2011, 所以就是二零一一年的时候，日本发生一个很可怕的地震。Okay, 很可怕 Yeah, and and the article continues with it killed sixteen thousand people and broke large parts of Japan's phone system. That's really bad. Yeah, I remember this earthquake. It was so terrible. It was all over the news, and everybody was talking about、oh, it. Really, I think it was like in high school.、Mm -hmm. I don't really remember it, but I think it was in my when I was in high school. It was a bad time. It was when、uh -huh. I just moved to China, actually. Oh, okay. And、uh, yeah, it was very scary. Um, but here we do have a magic、mm -hmm. box word.、Uh, the magic box word is broke, which is spelled B R O K E, and it's the past tense form of the word break. So if something breaks, it means that it no longer works. It is broken. So the huge earthquake made Japan's phone system stop working. It needed to be fixed. It broke.、Mm -hmm. So you broke your phone by dropping it into the swimming pool. Yeah, that's、you、a good can, example yeah, sentence. Yeah, you can make that. <laughs> yeah, I broke my phone by dro dropping it into the swimming pool. <laughs> did it happen really?、Uh, it did once. Actually, I didn't <laughs> drop it. I was using my iPhone, which I thought could go underwater、uh -huh. to take pictures. Oh no! And it turns out it can't really go underwater. So it is not waterproof. It's not completely waterproof.、Okay. It's water resistant. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> 那我们回到老师刚刚的句子，这个地震呢，它就杀死了一万六千人，而且破坏了日本大部分的电话系统。哎，那么老师这边刚刚讲的 broke， 它就是 break 的过去式哦。那么它的 past participle 是 broken， 所以是 break broke broken。Have you ever broken a bone? <laughs> I think when I was little once.、Oh, I don't really remember, but I think I did.、Mm, it really hurt. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, the article does continue, and it says. People couldn't call their families to check on them. So here we have a phrase to check on, and this is a phrase that means to find out the condition of something or to find out how something or someone is doing. And if you are baking a cake, for example, you need to check on it regularly to make sure it doesn't burn. And if you're worried about your friend, you should check on them to see if they're okay.、Mm, that's what I do.、Hmm, Every、nice. time there is an earthquake here, I just call my parents and. Are you okay, Mom? They happen in Taiwan quite a lot. Yeah. 那么就是说，人们呢没有办法打电话给他们的家人确认大家是否平安，所以才会创造了这个 line。那么 check on 呢，就是检查或查看的意思。Yeah, that's really scary. The first thing you want to do in a disaster is make sure that your family is,、oh, yeah. is okay.、Mm -hmm. And then the article continues. 
a South Korean internet business in Japan wanted to fix this problem. Okay, so a South Korean business based in Japan want to make it easier for people to check on their families and friends in case of a disaster, right?、Mm-hmm. And so there are two vocabulary words here for us to talk about. The first word is business, which is spelled B U S I N E S S, and business is a noun, and it's a word that means a company or profession. A business might have many people working for it, and you can find businesses across many industries. For example, a restaurant is a business. A clothes shop is a business. Well, A plus is a business too.、Mm. So, an example sentence would be: My uncle's business sells beds and sofas. My uncle's business sells beds and sofas. Okay, 那我们看一下 business 这一个字，它这边是企业啊，公司的意思。那么刚刚老师的句子里面出现 South Korean， 我们文章中这边指的是南韩的，所以 internet business 就是网络公司。所以南航的网络公司这边就是我们文章开头讲到的。那么 business 也可以当事物、本分或者是生意的意思。比如说，你可以讲 It's none of your business what I do。我做什么是不关你的事的。或者是 get down to business， 代表你开始做一件正事。所以，呃，比如说 Stop chatting， we should get down to business。那么回到老师的课文例句，我叔叔的公司卖床跟沙发。Hmm. So we have another word here. We do. Fix, and it's the word fix, and、mm-hmm. it's spelled F I X, and it's a verb, and it means to mend or repair something that is broken.、Uh, if something is broken, you should get it fixed. Just last week, for example, my TV stopped working, so I called a guy to come over and fix it. You can also fix abstract problems with solutions, so it's not just physical things that need to be fixed. So an example would be: Jerry asked his dad to help him fix the problem with his bike. Jerry asked his dad to help him fix the problem with his bike. That's what dads do, you know. Yeah, yeah, really. <laughs> so fix 就是解决、处理。那么一般来说也可以当修理呀、啊，决定、固定、牢记。其实它意思很多。譬如说 ，we need to fix up a time to meet， 就是代表说你必须决定一个日期见面。又或者是呢，固定在什么事情上面。My eyes were fixed on her beautiful hair. 我的目光呢，注视着她美丽的头发。那么 in the states we say be fixed into, which means、um, plan into. Do you say it in the UK? Not as much, but、okay. I've heard it before. Okay,、yeah. so it means be fixed into to do something, just like planning to do something. The 感觉，比如说 we're fixed into go out to dinner， 代表哎，我们正准备，我们我们决定要去吃出去吃晚餐。那么一个在日本南韩网络公司就很想解决这个问题哦。那么现在先看一个例句 ，Jerry 请他的爸爸帮他处理脚踏车的问题，所以可以当修理的意思。And then the article continues with they made line so people could chat on smartphones through the internet.、Mm, okay, wow, well, that's really smart. Yeah,、mm-hmm. so line was created to fix the problem that people couldn't call each other on the phone.、Uh, so the article says that people can chat using smartphones, and chat,、uh, spelled C H A T, it's a verb that means talk to somebody, or usually in a more casual way. We can chat in real life, face to face, or we can chat using messaging apps like Instagram, Facebook, or Line. Hmm. So they made the line that can let people talk through the internet on their phones. Okay. And the article continues. Line doesn't need a phone system to work. Because Line doesn't need a phone system to work. Because Line doesn't need a phone system to work. Because Line doesn't need a phone system to work. Because Yeah, you don't、mm-hmm. need those big phone towers. You just need no, the internet.、Uh-huh. And then the article continues again with now about twenty-one million people in Taiwan use Line. So that's a lot of people. I know. And、uh, one final grammar point here to talk about as well, and it's to do with numbers. The article said about twenty-one million people in Taiwan use Line. That's a lot of people. That's almost、like、all of them. It's almost everyone, right? <laughs> I know. OK， 我们来看一下这边有一个数字，英文的数字大家不要搞混。我们这边讲一个小小用法，大家就会记住了。我们先看一下最简单的 ，one 就是一，那么一百呢就是 one hundred。What about 一千 ？One thousand？ 嗯哼。And what about 一万 ？Now this is the one that's different from English. It's ten thousand. Yeah. OK. And yeah. Right. This is because 跟那个美国、英国的使用方式不一样。台湾说一万。可是呢，在英语系国家，我们是说十千，对，十千 ，Yeah， ten thousand。那么十万呢，也很不一样 ，One hundred thousand。嗯哼 ，Right， 就是一百个千，所以就是十万。那么一百万就是 one million。那么一千万呢，再加一个零 ，ten million。Yeah， ten million， 一千万。那么在一亿就往上爬，就是 one hundred million。那么当然呢，你后面可以加上复数可数名词，就代表有多少个什么。
，所以现在台湾大约有两千一百万人使用 Line。It's really interesting. It is the numbers. <laughs> well, thank goodness for Line. Hey, Jacqueline. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna start using it and more often. Yeah, and reply to my messages, please. Okay, I will. <laughs> so right here, we're going to our magic box, and then we will be back for our review time. Magic box, 照亮点 Hello, everyone. 我是 Casey. 不管在英文里面还是中文里面，如果数字大到我数不出来，我们就会用一些比较模糊的说法来代过，类似数以百计、数以千计，或是成千上万等等的说法来描述，对吧？今天呢，我们就来学学看该怎么用英文来表示这些数字的概念哦。在开始之前呢，我们先来复习一下，百这个单位的英文是 hundred， 千呢是 thousand， one。这个单位在英文里面没有哦，我们只能用十个一千，也就是十乘以一千 ，ten thousand 来表示。再往上的话呢，就是 million 百万，还有 billion 十亿这两个单位哦。至于该怎么使用它们呢？我们可以直接在后面加上可数的复数名词来表示有多少个。不过这时候你必须非常注意一件事情哦。单位词本身是不会被加上 s 来形成复数型的哦。像是呢，来举个例子，我在动物森友会这个游戏里面卖了两千颗苹果。I sold two thousand apples and made a lot of money. 而且我还赚了很多钱。大家有没有注意到呢？刚刚那句话里面加上 s 的位置是在苹果 apples 上面，而不是 thousand 这个单位词上面哦。这是因为呢，他们这时候是被用作呃数字来使用，而不是我们一开始认为的复数名词哦。但是呢，凡事是不是都有例外？这些单位词在某一个情况下也会被加上 s， 那就是我们一开始说的数以百计、数以千计，还有百万计等等这样的状况。像是呢 ，There are millions of people living in Taipei， 数百万的人居住在台北哦。那还有另外一个例句。There were thousands of fans in the concert. 在演唱会上面呢，有数以千计的歌迷。这些数量词呢，可以用它们的复数形态，再加上 of， 后面加一个复数名词来表达成千上万啊，上上千上万或者是上百万这样的概念哦。那我们就马上来复习一下，该怎么用英文说？大约有七百万人居住在这个大城市呢？ The answer is about seven million people are living in this big city. 你答对了吗 ？Wait for it! It's review time. 复习时间到喽。Okay, and our review game for today is the synonym game. Do you know what a synonym is, Chicklin? Ah,、uh, like they carry the same meaning or similar meaning? Yeah, pretty、okay. much. Yeah, a synonym is a word that has yeah the same or similar meaning okay, to another、okay. word. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you three or four words that are synonyms of one of the vocabulary words that we learned earlier. Okay. 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 So let's start with this one. I'm going to give you four synonyms. The first one is. Make, make. <laughs> the next one is design, produce, and generate. Design, uh, invent. Invent. No, 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 no. no we don't. We didn't have that, right? We didn't have we that have word. Four. We have another one.、Mm, that's similar to make some making something.、Mm -hmm. Uh, could be an idea or a real thing. So someone that's really creative. Yes. What do they do? They create things. They create.、Oh, so it's create our first vocabulary word. Yeah, create is a verb. C R E A T E.、Mm -hmm. Okay, and another one. Let's try this one. Let's try break, shatter, smash, and snap. Now I've kind of tricked you here because they are not synonyms. They are actually antonyms. Ah,、oh, the opposite ones. They have opposite meanings.、Okay. So let me say them again: break, shatter, smash, and snap. Break. So. Something that's not broken.、Mm -hmm. Weird. So, so when something breaks, you fix it. Yes. Okay, so it's fix. That's the word fix. Oh yeah. It's the opposite <laughs> of all those words.、Uh, I think we have time for one more. Okay. okay these will be synonyms this time. Okay. okay. So words that have the same meaning: structure, order, arrangement, and network.、Mm -hmm. 
So when something is in order, is it is well arranged. Mm-hmm. So Everything's working together. Something is organized. Mm-hmm. Uh, maybe it's a system. System is okay. correct. Okay. Yeah, like and the telephone system in the article. Oh, okay. All so right. I got all of them right. You did. You did very well. <laughs> and uh, I think that's all the time we have for today. So I'm Reese and I'm Chickling, and we are going to say goodbye. Bye. Bye. A plus Encyclopedia. The history of lime. Warm up question. What do you use your phone for most often? Hello, and welcome to the show. Today we're going to talk about a smartphone app. The question of the day is, why did Japan first create the Line smartphone app? A. It lets people talk without a phone system. B. It helps people pay for things more easily. Or C. People can use it to order taxis. The answer is A. It lets people talk without a phone system. In 2011, a terrible earthquake hit Japan. It killed 16,000 people and broke large parts of Japan's phone system. People couldn't call their families to check on them. A South Korean internet business in Japan wanted to fix this problem. They made Line so people could chat on smartphones through the internet. Line doesn't need a phone system to work. Now, about 21 million people in Taiwan use Line. Word power. Create. Create. My brother and sister created a new game. They made it up by themselves. My brother and sister created a new game. They made it up by themselves. System. System. My office changed our computer systems, so we are learning to use new programs now. My office changed our computer systems, so we're learning to use new programs now. Business, business. My uncle's business sells beds and sofas. My uncle's business sells beds and sofas. Fix, fix. Jerry asked his dad to help him fix the problem with his bike. Jerry asked his dad to help him fix the problem with his bike. Smartphone, app, application, chat.